name is Abed Iqbal, and I'm here really to tell you about an exciting project which is happening here on Thursday, the 27th of January 2011 at 5.30 p.m. For this project, we're looking for a number of musicians, singers, people who are interested in the DVD, which will be played uh, very shortly, uh, to rehearse for four workshops which are taking place here at Hollyhead School. And the the, the rehearsals and the workshops which will, lead, which will lead to a performance on the evening. I would like to now play you a DVD which showcases some of the artists and the style of music which will be used during the performances and workshops. If you can play the DVD, thanks. Um, at a, at a uh, Kuali uh, workshop, which is, uh, as you know, it's the first ever Kuali um, workshop which is taking place in Hansworth. Kids are rehearsing. Uh, we've, we've run a, a number of workshops. We've got a tabla player in, we've got a, uh, a harmonium player. And these kids are very excited. And the first time ever a Kuali is uh, taking place. And straight after this, there'll be a finale. And look at the way these, kid, these kids have never experienced Kuali music. Uh, or some of them have never had the um, opportunity to, to play music, but this is the first time ever um, they will be performing in front of a large audience, and it's great, exciting for Say Arts. and create that spiritual movement in this school here. Thank you very much. I'll uh, pass you over to uh, the Kowali Showcase for Sayas 2011. Thank you very much.
चुनरी ते रंग चढ़ा ले चुनरी ते रंग चढ़ा ले चुनरी ते रंग चढ़ा ले Abed Iqbal, Abed, right. um, it's Seance from Birmingham, which, uh, a, a company which promotes uh, international concerts, concerts from South Asia, from a garage. Uh, <laughs> but on a serious note, um, the demographics suggest that ethnic minority-led businesses are growing sus um, substantially in the West Midlands. They will be the majority in the next 10 years. How will the government respond to this change in terms of engaging with young British-born Indian and Pakistani entrepreneurs? Abed, uh, I think the most important thing here is, I don't know what we do specifically as government, but I think the most important thing is to celebrate the work that people like yourself are doing. And that's a great role model. Um, for many people, not just within the Indian or Pakistani community, but uh, uh, across the country. And uh, if you're really bringing overseas acts uh, over to this country, working out of a garage, that's great. And um, at some point, I know you'll be in a bigger set of premises and doing even bigger business. But I think the one thing that is helpful is sometimes when people like yourself are held up as role models uh, to some of the younger people in the community, that can make a big difference. And it's great, and good luck to you, and I hope you do fine. <laughs>